Hi everybody, this is Alex, CIO Instructional Designer. In this video, I'm going to show you how to upload your YouTube video to your Moodle course. So once you're logged in and you're in your YouTube account, um, you might be wondering where your video is. Unfortunately, um, you will not find your video over here on this page. Um, in order to do that, you have to go to your profile picture and then click YouTube Studio. This is because of the way YouTube stores um, the videos you have created. So once you're on this YouTube Studio page, um, please go to the left menu over here and then click videos. On this new page, you will see all the videos you may have created before. Um, in our case, this is the video um, I would like to upload. So I can do two different things here. I can either click here and then get a shareable link. You will see it will say link copy to clipboard. Or I can also click on the video and then click view on YouTube here. Hey everyone, this is Alex. Oops. And simply copy the link here. Either way will work. So I just wanted to show you um, your options here. So once you have your link, um, your video link, you go to your course. Um, in this case, I'm going to use IST256 um, as a sample course. And then um, you can go to the, the forums you would like to upload or um, the section you would like to upload the video to. So um, in my case, I'm going to use this Instructure Information Announcements and Help Forum. So you click here. And then I am sure you know the rest, how to create a discussion post. So we just click add a new discussion. And then let's give it a title. Welcome to IST256. And here you simply paste the video link and then click submit. After you submit it, uh, please go to discussion post to make sure your video is there and yay our video is over here as you can see um, posting the video to YouTube and then um, pasting the link here is um, a better option than directly uploading the video to Moodle because um, if you do so you might uh, face a couple of technical issues and also um, by doing using the video link the YouTube video link you do not use the server space we have um, so that's another reason to use the YouTube video link. Um, I hope this has been helpful. So if you have any questions, please feel free to email me. Thank you.